Well, howdy doody guys, this is Brad, and I'm American, and I got some Modern Warfare 3 game for you today, I got this a uh, few days ago, earlier this week, and, uh, well, I'm not gonna spoil it yet, but, uh, I get a 40 and 3, uh, domination, gun kills only, uh, not counting s grenades and knives and stuff like that. I don't even know if I get any kills with grenades or knives. And I, that's my first death of the game. So just remember, I only get two. I get only. I only get two more of those. So oh yeah, right here I'm just waiting because I don't know what I was doing. Because when I'm playing, I don't really know whether or not I should go one way or the other. I'm really indecisive, so I have to sit and think for a few seconds. So like I said or like I didn't say. This is a 43, 40 and 3 domination game with gun kills, and I poop on that guy's face with the M14. I'm using the M14, and I later pick up an M, uh, not an M16, uh, an AK-47, and, uh, and I put in some work. So, as I keep saying I'm about to say, or that I said, or I will say, um, I pretty much haven't said it yet, but I'm going to get that, so don't you worry about that. And essentially all I'm trying to say is, I go all Hiroshima on the enemy team. I'm not going to tell you what that means, and if you don't know how to read, well, you are going to find out later in this video what happens. So I get a little prize after I kill 40 people. Actually, not after I kill 40 people, but whatever. Whatever. I don't scratch that. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna talk about that because I don't know what I want to say about it. Oh, scorpions! I forgot about the scorpions. Oh, right there. That guy scared me because I didn't know. I didn't know if I actually downed him or if he was just running away. But uh. I want to talk about what I think about... Oh, actually, I think I get it soon. I don't know. I, I go to this part in the map a couple times throughout this game. Ooh, AK-47! That's my favorite gun. I'm going to I'm gonna unlock that with the... Uh, I'm going to keep that with a prestige token so I can always have it. It's my favorite gun. I use it in COD 4, Modern Warfare 2. And I'm, I plan on using it much, much more in this game right here. Uh, as soon as I start playing it a little more, I'm a little busy. College work, I gotta, I gotta have to pump out a research paper in a couple of days. Not looking forward to that. I have some shit going on tomorrow. Not looking forward to that. I have some gay stuff going on yesterday, and I'm not looking forward to that. And, uh, well... Now onto what I want to talk about. What am I gonna talk about? Well, I just want to say that I find MOABs easier to get than nukes in Modern Warfare 2. For my specific uh, play style, anyways, a lot of people would, would go the other way with that. But me, nope, 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 nope. And I'm going to tell you why. Dun, dun, dun. So everyone knows in Modern Warfare 2, you have to deal with the grenade launchers and the occasional bad spawn. And yeah, yeah, yeah. But all those fucking kill streaks. You always have to... Because I, di I didn't... I don't like running the high kill streaks and all these uh, controllable stuff. You know, I, I don't, I don't want to be taken out of the action, you know. You know, I, I, I'm I always, put, I, I'm, I'm the guy that wants to, you know, pop, 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 shoot you in the face. Pop, 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 put these high caliber rounds in the asshole of these little bitches. But, you know, that's just me. I don't want the kill streaks playing the game for me. Then you got these other people, they floop, 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 all this tossing this bullshit across the map. And then they get their hair, or their chopper gunner, and their fucking asshole launcher. I don't know. And they're playing the game for them. What, they get maybe seven, ten gun kills? And then they get a nuke instantly? That's bullshit. But in Modern Warfare 3, yeah, I have to deal with lag. Yeah, I have to deal with the shitty spawns. But Hard Hat and Fallen, the two maps I got the Moab on, I, when I think about it, it makes sense to me. Because it's like, those maps seem to, ha seem to have the least shitty spawns out of all the other maps, in my opinion. Maybe I just got lucky. I don't know. I don't know why that guy tried to knife me, but I don't know. Maybe he got done playing a session of Modern Warfare 2 commando knifing because he's a bitch. But whatever. We don't know that, now do we? I most certainly don't know that, and Americans know a lot of things. And I, and I speak the truth when I say I know a lot of things. Americans don't lie. Just remember that. And, um, you know? So yeah, in, in, in the Moab in this game, you know, you already have it. So I have three point streaks on. I don't have to give up a slot. And hell, consistency is a big thing too. Like, how often are you going to get a 25 kill streak? Well, you know, if it wasn't... Oh, there it is! There it is! Wait, 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 wait. Let's go back. Let's go back in case you missed it. Yes, guys, that just happened. I put a crater the size of Japan in the game. 
Now, I don't really care for Moabs and Nukes, but I, I really, really felt excited when I got it. I, you know, I didn't go for it. You know, I never ran for Nukes in Modern Warfare 2. I never actually ran for a Moab in this game. You know, I've gotten the 25 kill streaks in Modern Warfare 2. I've gotten it in this game, of course. I got the, the, the Moab twice already. And, you know, it's, because it, it's, you know, it's really counterproductive. You know, if you're trying to get a Moab, you're probably playing more defensive, of course. Well, luckily for me, I was on a map where I could just happen to defend the objectives while doing it. But I did it! And it was cool. Uh, you know, in Modern Warfare 2, I also don't like the fact that the nuke just ended the game. It's like, you know, you're not really playing the game. The kill streaks played it for you, and then you win the game because you're not playing the fucking game. But, you know, some people actually do go for nukes with their gun in Modern Warfare 2. So, props to you. You get a big bag of kudos. Uh, not just any bag of kudos. American kudos. I really don't know what kudos means, or where kudos came from, but that's what you get. You get kudos, my friend. And you're probably not a friend because you're Jewish. But that doesn't matter, you know. Uh, you know, I'm sure there, are, I'm sure there are lots of cool Jewish people in the world. You know, there's, there was that one dead Jew. There was a couple other ones. There was that that one that owned a jewelry store, and you know, there was a, the Jew that put noob tubes in Modern Warfare 2. That was that was pretty cool, right? Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me, man. Hell, there was there was even that Jewish person that had a that had a kid, a son. And he became Jim's dad in American Pie. That guy's pretty cool, right? I like Jewish people. Unless they're Muslim too. No, that's unacceptable. Not acceptable. One bit. But I'll see you guys later. Yeah, yeah. Eric almost stole my final stand kill right there.